Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to a new episode of my Hearthstone Adventures. In this one, we're playing things off, or starting things off rather, with Zed. Golden Zed in the mid lane against an Akali. Now, this video is going to be us. Uh, I'm, I'm going to be trying to get something special for you guys, something spicy, something that's really just taking over solo queue right now, but unfortunately, I got banned this game, so I couldn't bring it out. But next game, be ready, boys. Be ready. But if you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button, and I'll see. And uh, yeah, that's it. What am I saying? Can't even speak. Can't even speak. Why did he get assist? <gasps> I didn't get an assist on that. I had a dark harvest stack and everything there. I might the fiddlesticks. The second he saw me, he actually turned away from me. Dude, why you chicken? Thank you very much. Thank you very much, good sir. Thank you for the kill. Wait, we're actually like chilling here. Wait, I didn't get assist on that. Wait, what the fuck? How did that- Wait, how is that- in, How is she in a position to die? I don't get it. How does she end that hard? Oh. Middle 6 is there too. Run team, run! I'm coming, I'm coming. This is actually a decent fight, I think. If I get there fast enough. Come on, you almost kick in hard. Wait, they actually surrendered? Okay, I'll take the free win, I guess. Whatever. What the f okay. I guess for this one, we're playing a Jin, and we're playing Jin with a Dark Harvest. Now, Jin with Dark Harvest is actually quite spicy. It's really, really powerful because, uh, I mean, for obvious reasons, Dark Harvest itself is just broken. But Jin late game, man, if you stack it up, your ultimate can proc it, your W can proc it, you can finish people off with that, and like your fourth shot with Dark Harvest proc is just it just melts people down if they're really low like three percent hp fourth shot dark harvest you're pretty much dead at that point so it's pretty spicy stuff let's get this party started playing with pike also op champion let's go boys oh lord oh sorry gotta go sorry but she actually died well champs are good at dark harvest every single champion did Oh yeah, look at that Dark Harvest proc damage right there, baby girl. Drop for the Evelyn though. It's too risky to stay in farm. I don't know if she's level 6 or not. Arcane's level 6, so I have to kind of assume she's level 6 potentially. What are you talking about, boy? Aids. Dark Harvest, boys, a proc. Wait, what the fuck? She's full HP. Go, 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 team! Oh! Oh, yeah! Give me that, dude. That echo, what was that? So slow to go over the wall. Was it on cooldown? His thing better have been on cooldown there. We need to get some damage on this tower. I got a lot of dark harvest stacks there. It's exactly what I want right now. It's perfect. I want to see if I can help him out here. Dude, I... God... I don't know where this Evelyn is, but I'm honestly scared of her. She can like just constantly look for kills on me. I'm pretty easy to kill for her. <laughs> yeah, that was close. That was actually pretty close. Oh god. Shit. 
Oh, I'm actually trying so hard to like play these team fights, but I feel like I just I can't play these team fights. Gotta watch out for the Baron though. They might go for it. I mean, they're probably looking for it. They're, they're setting up and everything, so gotta be super careful. I mean, they're not doing the Baron, so we're fine. Okay, don't be. This Victor actually just got shit on. Wait, how the hell is Evelyn one shot him that hard? Yo, I gotta heal. Jesus Christ. Everyone does so much damage to me. Yo! Oh! I don't want to go yet. It's not my time. Oh. Dark Harvest? There it is. This is actually a pretty big fight for us, I think. Nice. Dark Harvest? Good to fight this. Dark Harvest? Woo! Jesus! Uh, how many stacks do I have? 13 stacks now? I actually got a lot of gold there. I guess we'll just reset and just keep farming, man. It was a decent fight for us. I don't know how. I mean, I think they overstayed. So, hey, we got a little something going for us. A little bit of a glimmer of hope we can say here. Nice. Oh god, he's a flash. Oh my. Dude, it's like uh, playing Jin is so hard here. Ah, uh, everywhere I go, there's people ready to kill me. Yeah, this is a little bit unfortunate. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, maybe it's still good actually. It's not over yet. Okay, okay, it's not over yet. Okay. Did they just take our inhibitor, or did it? Is it still down from before? I don't remember. Really? How is she shitting on me? It's a poppy. She's literally pure tank. Wait, she's literally a pure tank, and I actually just got a hard 1v1 by her. <laughs> Why? How? That doesn't make any sense, dude. Oh, man. Alright guys, the next game is about to begin for this one. We're playing Karthus down in the ball lane. Now, this is the champion that I want to bust out for you guys now. My only regret is that I'm not sure if this is going to be a good game for me. Uh, I mean, I have a talent support, number one. Uh, hopefully it's fine, but they have a Heimer Alistair, which is really, really good. But Karthus is arguably the most OP champion in League of Legends at the moment. He's literally permabanned. I, I actually didn't even think I'll get a Karthus game because he's actually banned super, super often. And the reason for that is because Karthus with Dark Harvest is insanely powerful. He scales really well, obviously. He gets past laning phase fairly easily, though I'm not facing AD carry, which kind of sucks. Um, but on top of this, if you go Leon with uh, Karthus, if you ult people, Right, your ult hopefully kills you know, let's say one target, right? Obviously, proc dark harvest, but also resets it. And then your Leandri, since it's ticking on the other four people, as long as they're under 50% with the Leandri's tick, it'll tick it on them as well and proc your dark harvest on them as well. So, pretty spicy stuff, guys. Let's get this party started. Let's do this. He's starting thing that we have to. Woo, baby, look at that. Woo, look at that first blood, though. Me and the talent popping off. Talent support? I like it. Never mind. Maybe it's pretty spicy. Fuck. Oh. Oh. 
No! Woo! Look at that damage! Get out of here, boy! Get out of here, boy! Look at that. Oh, we still got a kill from it. That's not honestly the worst thing in the world. So I'll take that kill for sure. I'm also stacking up my uh, Dark Steel. Again, card this, man. You don't care. You just As long as you get stacks of Dark Harvest, stacks of your Dark Steel. <laughs> Look at this card this, dude. This card is so broken. Like, I don't have to. It's just. Ah, I. Dude, I. I what a meta we live in, or rather, what a day we live in where Karthus is considered a good champion. Isn't that just insane? I think that's kind of crazy, to be honest with you. The Karthus is considered not only meta, oh, but broken. Literally, you're a broken champion. Give me the kills! Oh Yes! Kill him! Oh wait. Okay, nice R. You have to run. Oh wait. You can't kill me. Your talent support. Let's not forget. Oh my god. Go boys! Go, go, go! I'm so squishy, dude. This is actually inting like the new inting build, like straight up. This is actually just the new inting build. No, 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 no! I got him, I got him! No, I don't. You got him. It's all you, dude. It's all you. Nice. Okay, he's dead. <laughs> it's all you, dude. Got him, boys. Fight him, I think. Yeah, let's go, boys. Oh, got him right before I died. Hey, look at that. <laughs> I wish I had my ultimate there. I got it like a little too late. It was a pretty good hammer ult, actually. I have to say, I didn't see that coming. It was a really good ult. All right. Got the hunting guys upgraded. Now we're strong. Now this is where we get the actual Leandri's part of it. And it's going to make me a lot more powerful in these fights and my ultimate and everything. So this is going to be really nice for me. I don't have my ultimate yet. 20 seconds. We should, we should, we should never fight without my ultimate because the goal is like, you want to try just staying in fights for as long as you can, obviously with Karthus. And the second you die, you ult, because then, not only do you get the free ult, guaranteed, but your uh, Leandris is fully stacked for your extra 10% damage, which is a lot. Oh my god, I actually went Okay, I got two kills here. Boom! Sit your asses down, boys! Leandris, Leandris, killing the Vladimir! Okay! Look at that, dude. Press R in base, and I got two kills. I don't have to do anything. It's just, Karthus is actually... So broken. It's insane. Dark Harvest. If you want free lol, I'm telling you right now, this is what you want to play. This is literally the best champion in League of Legends right now. Like, I genuinely believe that. <laughs> Dude, then I get a shutdown. Another Dark Harvest stack. I'm getting insanely strong right now. Holy. Go, 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 go. Okay, I'm open. I'm just an ult. I don't care. Oh, look at that. Kill him. Three assists, no problems. Easy game, easy life. Dude, what do you want? What are you doing? Uh... It's all you, Echo. I set up the Echo. No, see that that flash was on purpose. It was 100% on purpose to set up the Echo. See, look, he gets a double kill, man. I get two assists on that. Eight stacks on this now. Oh, I want another. Alright, let's see how much damage this does to this Victor. Oh my god! Holy- <laughs> He just lost so much of his HP. Da da da! You're doomed, baby. Ay ah! Yeah, I got that damage on him too. Victor is super low. He's scared. He's scared to fight. Echo's looking for the end. 
Okay, this is it. Echo's going for the end. The victor cannot back. The victor is running back right now. He's trying to get there, but he cannot back because it will take him too long. The Echo has a Lich Bane. He is going to be going for the finish. He's the inting Echo. 673 is going to be looking for the finisher. The victor is on his way, but he's got to be really close, but he cannot make it in time. He actually backed in time. The Echo has a little bit of time remaining, but uses his ultimate just to be sure. Goes for the kill on Victor because he's so greedy instead of ending the game, but luckily for us, he still ends the game just in time before he dies. And yes, baby, let's go. Woo! Oh. Damage done the highest by far. That right there, boys and girls, is some massive damage. Karthus, broken, inting Karthus, whatever you want to call it. It is probably the best thing in this game at the very moment. So if you guys enjoyed the video, by the way, hit that like button. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you for the next one. Again, Karthus, play it for free low. Super OP, especially if you know, you know what you're doing. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing, and it still worked out quite well. And yeah, I'll see you guys for the next one.